We're hiking up the trail to Honeymoon Pass, which is a low point on Hawk Ridge. From the pass, we'll head left to ascend the center peak of Hawk Ridge. The trail starts on the left side of a creek, but here it crosses to the other side. It may not look like it, but we're still on the trail and Honeymoon Pass is ahead. After we reach the pass, we start climbing up a scree slope. We've never been in this area, nor could I find a route description, so this trip entails route finding. And we learn we have to get around this cliff first. On the other side of the cliff, we'll head up a scree slope. Climbing isn't easy here, so we'll go into the trees on our left. The dead trees are the remains of a forest fire that swept through the area in 2003. We'll climb through the dead trees for quite some time before they begin to thin out. Below is the valley that we hiked up. After a long ascent through a burnt forest, the trees begin to thin. We break out onto a meadow. We can't see the summit, but the ridge ahead looks like a good way to reach it. After we reach the ridge, it begins to snow. The green patch on the right is the meadow that we left a few minutes ago. We thought this was the summit, but it turned out to be a false summit. Visibility worsens as we approach another false summit. Dinah finds a rock that points the way. After climbing up here, we'll be only a couple minutes from the top. Because of poor weather, there is little to see of the surrounding peaks, but at least we make it to the summit. Yeah! 